So this is the Virginian RV park. I think this was $105 a night. I'm not quite sure, but it's booked up with no vacancies. And actually, to be honest with you, it's really nice. They've got trees between each unit. It's very clean, very well maintained. So maybe what I ought to do, maybe try to pick up some literature so I can tell you a little bit more about this park. But right now you're getting a drive through And there's a Beacon fifth wheel and an old Phaeton Tiffin bus, Fleetwood bus, Cedar Creek, Coachman, Airstreams. They've got a little bit of everything in here. Very nice, I have to say. So if you want to literally be five minutes down the street from Jackson Hole, the center of town, this is where you need to be. They've also got little, little cabins here, it looks like that they rent. In case you don't have an RV. So we're at the Virginian Lodge RV Resort. That's the manager right over there. He's been here since 1995. Um, and this is a gorgeous campsite, but before you even make the call to try to get in here, you can't be over 40 feet long with a motor coach. You can't be over 38 feet long with a fifth wheel. And with a travel trailer, it's 36 feet long. Uh, it's $106 a night. And literally, you are right down the street from Jackson Hole. Grand Tetons Resort, right down the street. Uh, and the recreation park with the toboggan sleds and everything else. Everything's within a 10 minute drive. So, if you fall under those prerequisites, then this is where I'd come. Because you do not have to travel far to do everything you want to do in the Jackson Hole area. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the road.